Welcome to the My Compass PA mobile app demonstration video on how to access and use the My Compass PA menu. Please note that while the menu is accessed by tapping one of the menu buttons at the bottom of the screen, this video demonstration will begin with an overview of the app dashboard. At the top right of the dashboard, the user will see a button. This button, also available on the app's login screen, indicates the number of broadcast messages available. Broadcast messages highlight, for example, the availability of new benefit programs and scheduled system maintenance. Broadcast messages can appear on the login screen when the user first opens the app. If the user views available broadcast messages before logging in, they can log in and tap this button to review the broadcast messages. When the user taps the button, available broadcast messages will appear in a pop-up. While this user only has one available message, if there is more than one broadcast message, back and or next buttons will appear in the pop-up under applicable message to allow the user to view available messages. If there is more than one message, on the final message, the user will be able to tap close to close the pop-up. This user has only one message. When they are done viewing the message, they tap the OK button to close the pop-up. Also on the dashboard, the user might see one or more alerts. Alerts appear when the user has closed or rejected benefits. For example, the alerts shown inform the user that they were determined ineligible for one or more benefits for which they applied. The user cannot tap on the alert to take further action, but they may choose to clear the alert from the mobile app by tapping the X on the side of the alert card. If the user wants to take action on this alert, they can tap the Benefits button on the left side of the menu. Viewing and acting on case and application information is covered in the demonstration video titled Viewing Benefit-Related Information in My Compass PA. Under Available Alerts, the app dashboard also allows applicable users to link their electronic benefit transfer, or EBT account, to the app to view their EBT balances, transactions, and card details. This user has not linked the app to their EBT account. This functionality is covered in the demonstration video titled, Viewing Your EBT Balance in My Compass PA. Below the EBT panel, the user might see personalized reminder cards. If they do, the app will inform the user how many reminders are available. In this case, the user has a few reminders. If the user has multiple reminders, they can view each by swiping left or right. The reminders that the user sees won't be reviewed in this demonstration. However, in general, reminders will either provide the user important information or prompt them to take action. In this example, the first reminder card that this user sees informs them that they can apply for LIHEAP preseason. If the user taps on the reminder card, they will be taken to their LIHEAP preseason application, where they can complete the LIHEAP application. LIHEAP preseason functionality is covered in the demonstration video titled Submitting a LIHEAP preseason application in My Compass PA. This user taps back in the upper left of the screen to return to the app dashboard. Under the Reminder Cards, this user has a Report a LIHEAP Crisis button. This is because the user has active LIHEAP benefits in the current LIHEAP heating season. Reporting a LIHEAP Crisis is covered in the demonstration video titled Submitting a LIHEAP Crisis Application in My Compass PA. If the user scrolls down, if they have open benefits or a case closed within the last 90 days, they will see their case benefits. In this example, the user has active benefits. If the user taps a benefit card, they will see their benefit-related information. Please note that this functionality is covered in the demonstration video titled, Viewing Benefit-Related Information in My Compass PA. This user taps back in the upper left of the screen to return to the dashboard. Having looked at the broadcast messages, alerts, and other possible dashboard selections, We'll now look at the My Compass PA menu located at the bottom of the screen. The menu offers the following selections. Home, which allows the user to go back to the home screen. Benefits, which allows the user to access their benefit details. Documents, which allows the user to view and or upload requested verifications and documents. And, addressed in a moment, messages, and more. 
Please note that benefits functionality is covered in the demonstration video titled Viewing Benefit Related Information in My Compass PA. Documents functionality is covered in the demonstration video titled Uploading Documents Using My Compass PA. And Messages functionality, specifically how to opt in or out of viewing notices in semi annual reporting form, or SAR, in the app, is covered in the demonstration video titled Receiving Notices in My Compass PA, Going Paperless. This demonstration video focuses on the Messages and More selections. To begin, this user taps the Messages button in the menu. This Messages screen appears. Here, the user can download and view their notices and manage their email preferences using the Settings button in the lower left of the screen. To view any one of the notices, the user will tap the corresponding download button in the right of the respective notices card. The app will show a PDF image of the notice. If the notice has more than one page, the user can scroll through the notice's pages. The user can close a notice by tapping the back button in the upper left of the screen. If they close the PDF, the app will return to the previous screen. Looking at the screen, it's important to note that a red dot will appear beside unread notices. Further down the screen, the user can tap the Settings button. Doing so will take the user to a screen that allows them to change their email address and or opt in and out of receiving their notices and SAR electronically. Please note that if the user never provided an email address as part of account creation or provided an email address but never enrolled in receiving either notices or SAR in the mobile app, when they tap the Messages menu button, they will first see a screen similar to this one. The screen will prompt them for an email address and or give them the option to enroll in e-notices by toggling the notices and or SAR selections. This functionality is covered in detail in the demonstration video titled Receiving Notices in My Compass PA Going Paperless. This user taps the Back button in the upper left of the screen. The next item in the menu is the More button, which this user taps. The More screen includes the My Compass PA mobile app helpline telephone number and hours of operation, frequently asked questions, an app tour, the confidentiality and waiver statement, the privacy policy, the HIPAA notice, voter registration info, app version information, and a logout button. This user taps View Frequently Asked Questions, FAQs. The FAQ screen that appears will include a series of frequently asked questions and the answers to those questions. To view the answer to a question, the user can tap the downward facing arrow to the right of the question. To close the answer, the user can tap the now upward facing arrow to the right of the question. This user taps the back button to return to the previous screen. The next selection is View App Tour, which this user taps. The App Tour screens show users, at a high level, what they can do in the app. The user can tap the Next button at the bottom of the screen to navigate through the App Tour, or they can tap Skip to Home directly under the Next button at any point in the tour to return to the More screen. This App Tour screen shows the user an example of the app dashboard. After reviewing each screen, the user will tap Next. The remaining screens show the location of the EBT widget, which allows the user to view balances, transaction history, card details, and to change their PIN, where to see pending applications, submitted forms and case benefits in one place, where to upload required documents and review already submitted ones, where to view and submit changes to case details, where to view important communications, where to complete and submit a SAR form without leaving the app, and where to submit a LIHEAP application or LIHEAP crisis report within the app. To close the app tour, the user taps Next, and they are returned to the More screen. The user taps the next selection, Confidentiality and Waiver Statement. The Confidentiality screen contains a scrollable statement that the user can access at any time. After reviewing the statement, the user can tap the Back button to return to the More screen. On the More screen, the user also has the option to view the Commonwealth Privacy Policy.
the user taps the Privacy Policy button. The Privacy Policy will open in the device's browser window. This is a scrollable screen. After the user reads the Privacy Policy, they can navigate back to the My Compass PA application on their mobile device. Once again on the More screen, the user also has the option to view the HIPAA notice. The user taps the HIPAA Notice button. The Notice of Privacy Practices will open. This is also a scrollable document. After the user finishes reading the statement, they tap back to return to the More screen. On the More screen, the user also has the option to view voter registration info. The user taps the Voter Registration Info button. The Voter Registration application will open in the device's browser window. This is a scrollable screen that will allow the user to download a blank voter registration form or complete the form online using this page. This user is already a registered voter. They navigate back to the mobile app. The last selection on the More screen is the Log Out button, which this user taps. The user is returned to the App Login screen. Thank you for watching this My Compass PA mobile app demonstration video. Please note that links to all My Compass PA demonstration videos appear in the video description below. Have a great day.